objectives are, uh, number one, to welcome kids back in a smooth fashion. And to that end, we're trying to tie down all the construction that we've had moving along this summer. Just about all of that is completed now. So number one, students will, will be able to enter school and the building should be in pretty good order. Um, we have an ongoing objective or initiative in the area of student well-being and to try to continue to um, keep our eyes on uh, the habits and also the stressors of our students and continue to develop a program, an educational program that takes into account all, all of a student's needs and not just academic needs. Um, and ditto for our staff, we're trying to make sure that we um, just the way we don't want to overload students, we don't want to overload staff members and have them suffering from burnout, which translates to uh, less of a positive experience for students in the classroom. Um, and then beyond all of that, of course, we are always in the business of delivering the New Jersey core curriculum content standards or New Jersey student learning standards as they're now known uh, and ensuring that uh, the experience that our students have here in Chatham exceeds uh, the, the baseline requirements in the state of New Jersey and provides them with the, the absolute best, best education that we can, we can give them. So a couple of years ago we thought we really had reached a point where we had more devices in the district than students. We had kind of hit that one-to-one -one, um, threshold and we developed a plan um, to distribute devices for students to take home at the middle school and the high school. Okay. Last year we distributed devices to all middle school students and this year we are distributing devices to all high school students. And on top of that, at Lafayette Avenue School now, we have a device per student, but those students are young and we don't issue them for, uh, for the students to take and home. Google is, uh, what Google Classroom can offer and what a lot of these learning apps can offer um, is really, it enhances and promotes learning. I do have concerns, though, about the amount of screen time that students are getting. Um, I certainly have lots of concerns about social media and cell phone use, um, but that really, in some ways, is runs independent of the Chromebook. Um, okay. So when you're doing work, you know, if you're if you're using Google Sheets, which is like Microsoft Excel, to okay. assemble data or um, you know analyze a, a set of charts. That's quite different than being, you know, uh, on a social media platform where students are maybe not uh, being as kind as they should be to one another, or there's this ever-growing sense of I need to be liked and I need to be popular and I need to have uh, a certain number of followers. That kind of thing I think is not as healthy for kids.